everyone, Lewis here, and I thought I'd bring some recent news relating to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. I'm sorry for the lack of a Pokemon Go news video during the final week of December. It was because of the holidays and I was dealing with the recent passing of my dog, Potter. But I'm back with a brand new episode, the first one of the new year, the first one of 2022, and we're going to start with this week Niantic has announced that they are doing Community Day Classics in honor of the Season of Heritage, starting with Bulbasaur coming back, in addition to, to our normally scheduled Community Day with, with Squeal, we are getting Bulbasaur again, and like the original times in the past with Community Days, it will be from 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. local time, January 22nd, on Saturday. And of course, you will be able to get Venusaur with Frenzy Plant if you evolve Ivysaur to Venusaur. And of course, unlike the original Bulbasaur Community Day, you will get a $1 or equal equivalent ticket if you choose to buy it in the in-game store, which is a special research event. And of course, also unlike the original Bulbasaur Community Day, Photo encounters featuring Bulbasaur will also be part of this. And of course, I will not only be making a YouTube video about this event, but I'll also be live streaming it over on Twitch as well. In other Pokemon news, also announced this week that we're getting a another event connected to Season of Heritage, and that is Mountains of Power which will bring the debut of Shiny Slugma and of course Mega Aerodactyl which of course Aerodactyl will be available as a Shiny if you encounter one and of course Heatran will be the legendary raid boss that returns if you didn't get a Shiny Heatran before when it was first introduced here's your chance to get one during this and of course it will be live by the time this video is up on January 7th and it will end Thursday January 13th and of course the times for it will be January 7th from 10 a.m. to Thursday January 13th at 8 p.m. local time Also, the XP challenge for Season of Heritage is now live. The only way you can access this is if you had bought the ticket for Johto Tour. And of course, you get as a reward the Gumi Hat. And of course, this is Candelia's challenge. And of course, next month, if you bought the Johto Tour, will be the Catching Challenge which will be Sparks Challenge, which of course last month we had Blanche's Challenge, which was the Stardust Challenge. And of course, earlier this week we had the um, New Year's event, which actually started last week. And of course it's come and gone. It brought shiny Hoot Hoot which, of course, normal shiny hoot hoot is now available if you can find one in the game. One more thing. I will be streaming, as I always do, on Twitch. Saturday, 1 p.m. to at least 3 or 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time 
over at Twitch TV. Yeah, twitch.tv slash Lou Adventures. And of course, for the stream in regards to Bulbasaur Community Day, that will probably be a shorter stream because of the later start time. And the fact that it also requires me to also finish the video first before I start the stream. And I look forward to what 2022 brings in Pokemon Go. Thanks for watching, everyone! You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Twitch, and TikTok. And remember, it's time for adventure! Also, during these times when heading out, wear a mask in public indoor settings. You can also double mask, practice social distancing, Carry hand sanitizer with you. Wash your hands. Most importantly, get vaccinated, get boosted, and of course, stay safe, stay healthy, and together we are finally getting through these start times together, but we're not out of the woods just yet.